thank you for tuning in. I got a 66 Plymouth Satellite. This car's got great looks, V8 power, console shifted 727, and it is very, very original. Tune in, we're gonna show you around, take you for a spin, and one of our new arrivals here at La Fontaine Classics. Kicking things off up front, we're dealing with an original bodied car. It's been restored. The fitment is quite impressive. All of the trim in great condition. This grill is believed to be the original. Lettering across the hood, original. And the hood ornament is a survivor bit, still holding up and in great shape. I have a hood release just under here, and it's a two-part latch. We have one more right here. This opens up like so, revealing a really nicely detailed engine bay. This is a 318, just what this car was born with. It's been upgraded, done away with the stock two barrel, and it's got a four barrel equipped on there. See some new hoses, clamps, a couple of gaskets and seals, all very clean. We've got our original fender tag still intact here. Sequence number still on the back of the radiator support. I dig it. Really clean, even the underside of this hood looks beautiful. Seal is in great shape, not cracked up, nice and supple. We'll get this uh, running for you guys in just a moment. Closes up good. Man, the fender and the door almost look like one piece. The gaps are so good. I like the molding, wheel arch, top of the fenders. And the body side molding, those are all in great shape. Those look to be newer. We got a nice set of Redline tires on here around a Mag 500. That's a 14 inch, and it's a F70 Firestone. Sport mirror, really cool. Great gaps back here. I love the roof lines on this year Mopar. Out back, same wheel and tire, like the simulated spinner hubcaps there. Dual exhaust, nice tail panel. That looks to be a new piece. Let's see what we're working with in the trunk. Very good. This is original paint up under this. Original jack instruction sticker, insides of the quarters, uh, and backsides of these wheel tubs. That is all original stuff. Original seam sealer everywhere. It's a clean, dry, southern car. And up underneath here, we've got a spare, and the jack is mounted right over here. Close up great. Tail light lenses and surrounds look good. The moldings this car got is really slick. That satellite's a rather high trim model and it shows a lot of beautiful accents all over this car. Can't wait to show you some more of them inside the interior. Wow. Door cards are factory fresh. Nice slick little handle release and window crank looking good. Bucket seat car with the console. Love the finish on this. Love all the embroidering throughout these seats. Factory two spoke steering wheel frames a 120 mile per hour speedometer. We've got gauges for coolant temp, fuel level, amp meter and oil pressure uh, warning light. Heater controls right here. It's 94,000 miles on the clock. The factory trans audio AM radio right here. Carpet kit looks to be new. In the glove compartment, we have the original owner's manual, and they were even trying to sell you uh, an air conditioner for your home back then as well. We still have the original window sticker with this car and all of the documentations from the dealer. This Plymouth store actually was a John Deere and a Plymouth dealer all in one location. It's pretty cool. The rest of this interior looks great. Mirror looks perfect. Visors are in great shape. Headliners nice and tight from front to back. A-pillars looking good. And look at the chrome work we have inside the car. All around the back window, nice and tight. All our dome lamps, interior lighting's working good. Rear seats are in excellent condition. Ashtrays for both the rear passengers. Love seeing that right in the center there. A nice accent piece. And we got dual speakers up in the package tray. All our gauges appear to be working good. Pointing straight. straight down the road, it's driving straight. Running really smooth, up and down shifting quite nicely as well. Indicator light turning on on the dash like it's supposed to. This road's pretty broken and it's just rolling over everything nicely. Very comfortable car. Windows roll up and down nice. These little quarter vent windows are a savior on a day like today. Actually feeling pretty comfortable in here now. Hey, not bad. This 318 woken up a little bit. 
That's, that feels really nice. A little radio down here. I mean, the Pelosi and, and Hakeem and, and uh, Schumer. Yeah. AM radio plays nice. Light pull over here. This stuff is just all nice and smooth. Quick recap, Southern Living Car, original window stickers, body, and a whole bunch more. Check out the link down in the description of this video. It'll take you over to the full listing on our site. We got a whole bunch of pictures of this car, the underbody shots, close-ups of that window sticker, whatever other documentation we got with it. Last but not least, while you're down there, click and like, subscribe, and share if you enjoyed, if you know someone looking for something like this. And also, too, check out the rest of our inventory. We got a lot of cool cars in right now that we're real excited about. Thank you guys for watching. Mackenzie with LaFontaine. Peace and out.